Okay, so our next half of the A side, half of the B side, then you mix it, it will have bubbles, you mix it until it's clear, no longer cloudy, it takes a couple minutes. Then I grab one of my small and I pour a little bit in here. I'm gonna add a little bit of orange because I need to make some for Thanksgiving. And then you add whatever color you want. I'm going to go ahead and add some orange glitter. Whichever color you want. Um, I'm going to go ahead and add a little bit of sparkle to it. A little more sparkle. Whoa, okay, that was a little, a lot. Get this, we're gonna swirl it around. Nice and mix. Okay. And you come in here in your mold. You just pour a little bit in there. Pour a little bit in there. I don't like mine too thick. I was doing trial and error. So I found that the ones I was doing was a little thick. The thicker they are, the heavier it will be on your bow. And of course we don't want to have a heavy bow. Once those are dry, I have my image. I used um, a little bit of Mod Podge Put a little dot on the back of the image and then put it on the center of my finished one. So then after that, to get it shiny and clear at the top, you're gonna take some of your already mixed resin. And you're just gonna create a small little layer and I just go around it and make sure that the whole thing covers. Oops, so sorry. You want it to cover the whole top. Um, you know, don't try to get it. Okay, so now it's over the whole top. I do. Um, use a heat gun. It's my heat gun. Uh, so then you're just going to hit it because it has a few bubbles and I just want to make sure there's no bubbles on top. As you can see, there is a few bubbles in there. So I want to make sure that there's um, no bubbles. So I just turn it on low. You know, a little bit. And then hit me. And it pops the This one will be done. It's a little bit skinnier now um, versus these that I were doing was pretty thick. These are way thinner and you can save on resin. So once these are done, it's going to look like that. Then like I said, you take a dollop of the Mod Podge 
and then you can put a layer like I did on this one. And after that dries for about 24 hours, you can see there's no bubbles in it anymore. And after that dries, then they're good to go. All right, I hope you enjoyed my video. Take care, guys.